Before a 737 even starts rolling, its wings are already trying to fly. At full takeoff power, the lift is so strong, the aircraft can start unweighting its own landing gear, with the brakes still locked on. The 737's wing is designed to generate serious lift at low speeds. When takeoff thrust is set, the engines blast high speed air over the wing route. That energized airflow actually creates lift while the aircraft is stationary like a mini takeoff happening under the skin. That's why 737 pilots do not just slam the throttles. They stabilize the engines at around 40% N1, then smoothly advance to full power. It stops the nose from lifting early, keeps the aircraft planted, and ensures the engines are stable before the takeoff roll begins. This pre-lift effect is most noticeable on lightweight departures and cool, dense mornings. Push too much power too fast and the jet will nudge forward even with the brakes on. Procedures are designed to handle this behaviour with precision because the wing's doing its job before the wheels even turn. Even at zero knots, thrust creates real lift. The wing tries to fly before rotation. Stage thrust keeps everything smooth and controlled. It is proof of just how aerodynamically aggressive the 737's wing really is. When pilots say it wants to go, they are not exaggerating. The wing is already flying.